Hey guys, what's up? My name is Sean Result and welcome to my Samsung Dex videos. So someone in the in the Dex um, group asked on how to use VNC Viewer or a similar app on Samsung Dex. He said the VNC Viewer doesn't work properly for him. Um, so, let's, so let's actually go ahead and use and use VNC Viewer remote desktop on Samsung Dex and also on a Windows 10 laptop. Although it works on Apple, Chrome OS, Raspberry Pi. It works on a bunch of it works on a bunch of different stuff. I'm going to be using my Windows 10 laptop. It's sitting here next to me. I can't show it now though, but I have it here next to me. Basically, it's a remote desktop app similar to Team Viewer or Microsoft Remote Desktop or a bunch of different ones. Um, although VNC Viewer is not free, you have to pay to use it. Um, so, I, so I just simply wait and I, and I signed up for a trial version. Um, I will have an upcoming video where I do use Team Viewer and Remote Desktop for Microsoft. And I, will show that, and I will show those as well. But this video is just simply for VNC viewers specifically and for this guy. Um, let's go ahead and actually use VNC viewer remote desktop and see how it works. So first of all, you can go and install the free Android app for it. There's a free Android app. I already installed mine. And I have the app, uh, the, the app open right now. I'm going to close the app. And just properly close the app. Okay, then you can also go on, go onto your Windows 10 laptop or your Apple computer or whatever you are using. Go to it and just simply sign, sign up for a trial. Or if you have an account, then just simply, I guess, um, sign in and download the VNC Connect app. So as soon as you have, um, as soon as you have signed up for a trial version, you must download the VNC Connect app on your or on your Windows 10 computer. So I have the app already installed on my on my computer. So now I'm simply going to go onto the onto my Windows 10 computer. I'm going to sign into my um, my v real VNC account. I already did that, and then you can open up the Android app, and you can also sign into your um, real VNC account on the Android app. Um, I'm currently signed, signed in already, as you can see from here. And then as soon as you see you've signed in, you'll see it says here Desktop 4K Show. So that's basically my computer. All your all your computers where you are signed into the, the account will show up here, and you can also add more here, I guess. By giving it the, the IP address as well as the computer name, you can add more. Although mine just simply showed up there automatically. Then you can also simply click on it. As soon as you, as soon as you click on it, it will ask for a username and for password. Then you can enter your, your username and password. And as you can see, it works perfectly. Here is my um, Windows 10 laptop, my Windows 10 laptop um, desktop here. But as you can see, it's currently in a very, very small window. And there isn't a maximize button either. So it doesn't really work that nicely. Um, so yeah, so I so will actually fix this. So you can actually just simply, just simply make, make this um this window go full screen. So I'm gonna press the oh shit. I'm gonna press the Windows key plus up key. Ah, just click on it first. And then the app goes full screen and it works perfectly then. Um if the Windows plus up key doesn't work for you, or if you don't have an Android full screen button on your keyboard. Then you can um, download an app called um, Dex Hub, and this app I have a review on that app as well on my channel. And then you can actually um, use that app and enable the shortcut keys to then use this if it doesn't work for you by default. And uh, basically, yeah, yes, the app it works perfectly. I can now access my Windows 10, my Windows 10 laptop here, and as you can see, here is the VNC server app as well. I have it open here. It's opened on this small window. Basically, um, this one here is a 4K screen. Then I have a small 1080p screen also connected to my laptop, and that's why the one is big and the one is small. And uh, you can also zoom in. So, is a way to zoom in. Not sure how exactly. Um, previously, when I, when, I, when I tested the app, it it zoomed in by 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 default on its own when I tried to use it. Um, ah, that just changes my desktop icons. Okay, so there's a way to zoom in. I can't remember how now. Um, previously, it just automatically zoomed in for me. Let's see. Uh, there's my desktop size. And so you can enable the shortcut keys and then you can... Why can't I? Okay. You can enable the, short shit, the shortcut keys or the buttons, but of course you have a, a Samsung Dex, you have the keyboard controls. Uh, I'm just trying to see how I can zoom in right now. Um, okay, so you can make go, you can make the app go go go, go complete, completely full screen, and then you don't have a toolbar there. 
Um, I'm assuming that most of you guys will, will won't have two, two displays. You can have one display. So it will automatically be full screen, I think. Not sure, actually. Um, why did it go full screen the previous time? I don't know. Um, what happens if I type something? Nothing. But yeah, it works. You guys can actually access your Windows 10, your Windows 10 laptop here. It works perfectly fine. I think most people... Um, won't really be using this um, because it costs money and I still prefer, personally, I still prefer TeamViewer as well. So you can please just search on this. Let's search for myself, Sean Result, my, on my Windows 10 browser. I just typed my own name incorrectly. And my browser, seems, my browser seems working fine, everything. Um, yeah, there's not much more to show. Um, the app works in Samsung Next. So let's go ahead and give the app rating on Play Store. So I'm going to say it could it could work better. Oh yes, I'm a beta tester for the app now, so I can't really review the app. I'm going to say um, the app doesn't, wait, the app could, wait, ah, the app needs improvement on Samsung Dex. So yes guys, that's basically it for this video. I just simply wanted to show you guys, um, or show, or, show, or show this guy and you guys um, how, real, how VNC Viewer works on Samsung Dex perfectly and how you can use then it to access a remote desktop computer. And yeah, I'm quite impressed with this app. It works fine, although it could work much better. Um, in the next video, I will try out Team Viewer and Microsoft Remote Desktop. But for now, yes, there's this app and it works fine. So, yes, I will see you guys in the next video. And if you enjoyed this video, then make sure to leave a thumbs up on this video and subscribe for more videos. And basically, why people use this app is just simply to access a a um a different computer that that, that might be far away, and not close by. So.